m 0 fxb welcome to my channel and learning about ham shack hotline and in this case other sip servers so if you look here uh, you can apply for a iax2 trunk setup in free pbx free pbx is software that you can use for looking at this and i'm completely new to this a trunk extension number so before setting up a trunk connection to HH, you will need to request an IAX2 trunk extension number. So this is the, all the instructions how to actually do that. And I am going to have a go at this, but right now it's just information and links um, for people that are interested in SIP type devices and ham, and ham radio. Now it, within this, I've noticed that we've got this one here um, from KE8LCM where he talks about his own PBX server. So there are other people that are running servers that ham radio operators can connect to, and these are the list of current PBX extensions. So, and I, I will look into, you know, joining the group, because I like to just join in and be part of um, amateur radio group. The other thing I've noticed is that on a link to this here, a wire, there is amateur wire. So look, if you look here, welcome to amateur wire, Amateur Wire is an alternative VOIP phone service. We run a service similar to Hamshack Hotline System. We're not looking to compete. Um, we are a service that can be used as an alternative. So, and I'm, the next thing I'm going to learn is how to create an account and become part of this group as well. Because to me, the more of us having fun with these different SIP type devices um, that look like, um, let's have a look here. We can find, go to Hamshack's main page, HA. Ham check hotline here. There you go. That's what they look like. So the smart devices, and they're quite inexpensive. So just some info and links here, and more on it later on. So seven three, and thanks to KE eight LCM and Ham Shack Hotline. All the best.